to be good at it. You have to know what you're doing. That's that's the real issue. Yeah, I mean, and you, and you know, and filmmakers who who have something they want to say will keep doing it. Well, Peter and Blair made this happen. Yeah, and hopefully somebody will uh, will go see it. I mean, you know, Joni Levin and Keith Clark, who who had got had the property, had it for 14 years trying to get the picture made, and Peter read it and got excited about it you know they couldn't believe it he's very picky they were over the moon yeah well he was picky he should be he was a right to be so you enjoyed working with him before yeah the Truman show was you know nothing like this in terms of the time we spent on Truman I was just on it for a couple of weeks I think but and that happened very quickly I was cast a couple of days before I started filming. you were fabulous in that oh thanks but but the the opportunity of working with Peter and just the, for that short time and seeing how he dealt with the crew, seeing how he dealt with the with me and the other actors, um, his thoroughness and total like laser like focus, you know, on what's going on. It's really great as an actor to know because you're not on stage, you don't have an audience, but when you're working on a Peter Weir film, you know somebody's paying attention because he's riveted and he'll he he's aware of every inflection, every move you make, every button on your jacket, every strand of hair or lack of whatever and you know he's just you just know you're being taken care of you know you're being cared for you know you, somebody's really checking it out and will help you you know specify whatever it is necessary if you're not getting there how, how many takes would he ordinarily go for not too many once he felt he got it you know Unless there was something that he was really going for that wasn't quite happening, you know. And did you guys have a conversation about the accents and how you were going to all handle that? I mean, you yeah, got well, to be I mean, yourself. Yeah, well, I didn't have to worry about yeah. too much because when I was an American fellow, I had to, obviously I studied the Russian quite a bit. There was a great uh, fellow there who, who helped us all with the Russian. Um, you know, and I know Colin worked really hard on it. And, and, you know, and Jim, who's English, you know, and Polish accent. Um, yeah, I mean, he dealt with, we had, we're all we, from different countries. Yeah, yeah. We, but we all worked very difficult. And some of the Romanian guys had, had to work on their English, you know, to be understood, um, uh, try to lessen their accents a bit. And, uh, but then Peter would, would, uh, you know, he was very aware of the progress that people were being made, that people were making and, um. He, he, you know, he, he's, he's he's aware of every aspect of the film being made. I mean, he, that's what I love about him. He's so thorough; it just it kind of blows your mind. You so, so the, you talked about the desert and you talked about the snow, but there's also some serious climbing, or does it just look more serious in the film than it actually was? We don't ever do any real rock climbing per se, precipice kind of stuff. Mm. Um, I mean, it's just it mostly was, a lot some, of some of it's pretty steep. Yeah, walking. Um, but it was more the, it's more the persistence of these people and the grueling day to day, and finding something to eat and finding water, particularly in the desert, you know, and and the effect of the sun, you know, blistering everybody up. And but it was kind of neat because what we started out with is what we used. In other words. I had I took the lining out of my initial winter cap, had that little cap, took the lining out of my coat to make that vest. Uh, I made fishing line out of thread from my jacket, uh, a little piece of barbed wire that actually did work into a hook and sharpened up, on, you know, stone. And and so we all had these things that we were doing all the time. A lot of some of that's in the movie, and a lot of it isn't. You know, the, the real detail of of the stuff that we were always working with, and I love that kind of stuff. You know. Everybody was uh, partaking of that. Well, thank you, Ed. Thank you very much. It You're is welcome. an absolute pleasure to see you again, as Same always. Glad you liked the movie.